The might can pierce, shoot from the body like the sharpest sword, and pass power to the puck. The cold runs through the breath, makes the player fear. Fumbling, tumbling, there's no last minute in the rink. Puck, player, wait for a chance to win. I've been playing ice hockey for two years, and during this time, I improved from the most stupid one in the rink to the only girl in the ice hockey school team. Ice hockey is actually pretty new in China, so not even many boys play it, and it was really rare for me to pick it up. I was attracted by it because it was so similar with the feeling of flying. I was extremely passionate that I wanted to join in the ice hockey team and became、um, a valuable player. I felt like I could do anything to achieve my goal, so I started to do extra exercises. I started to think about ice hockey even during the meals. I thought I really made it part of my life. I always know that the process of playing ice hockey is hard. Ice hockey is really intense. It's really cruel. It is actually the repetition of falling and tumbling. But for me, it's important. It gives me something. It gives me braveness. It gives me a lot of new friends. It gives me a new interest. It really became something that could be called passion. Ice hockey really teaches me how to stand up. I always believe that the best players are the ones that being able to accept falling and being able to stand up again. So I would love to fall for it and to struggle for it. People always said that we needed to grow up under resistance, but ice hockey taught me that even when the resistance disappeared, it's actually more difficult to stand up while having less force of friction. After playing ice hockey, I know that the power in the heart could be sharper than the blade.